Hey everybody, I wanted to get on here today and talk a little bit about something that most women face and that is weight gain <laughs> and weight gain sucks. Um, I have gained probably 15 pounds and I know looking at me right now, you might not be able to see it. I tend to put all of my weight into my midsection. So, and high waisted pants really help if you're looking to cover that up at the gym, but you know, there's my, and, and again, it's, you know, I know it's not a huge, it's not a big deal. I'm still healthy. Um, I'm still very fit. I can go out and still run five miles and, you know, do this and that. And it's not like I've fallen off the deep end and I'm just eating cheeseburgers and, and that type of thing. I still enjoy my healthy lifestyle, um, but I have gained 15 pounds um, in the last few months. And I've decided that I am not going to try to lose that weight. So here's my, here's what typically happens for me. Um, I typically um, will restrict and restrict and restrict. And then I go through these cycles of intense hunger and cravings and binges. And, um, you know, at first, when I first started dieting, I would be able to hold the binges off for months at a time. And so I was able to get pretty lean. Um, by the end, I couldn't keep myself from binging, um, you know, every few days. And so something that I realized this, this last time that I gained, you know, I've gained this 10 to 15 pounds and I, I really don't weigh myself. I just know by how my clothes fit um, and I know by how I feel that I've, that I've probably gained right around that amount of weight. But um, this last time, um, when I realized that I had, you know, that I was gaining weight, that I had gained this weight, my immediate gut reaction was to go on a crash diet which is what I would normally do. So do like um, a two week juice fast or do some sort of a cleanse um, and try and get rid of the weight really fast. And um, I decided this time not to do that because I came to a realization that it is the dieting. It, it is diets that actually are causing me to continually gain weight. And let me tell you, it gets harder to lose the weight every time that you gain it. Um, your body gets more and more efficient at not only putting weight on, but holding on to it. And so I've decided to quit dieting. And this time, I'm just going to leave my weight alone. If I never lose this, this 15 pounds, or even if I gain more weight, um, I'm just going to try and, and, and just deal with it. And this has actually been really helpful for me as a, um, as a mom, as a trainer, as a coach, because I've had to come to grips with the fact that the lifestyle that I want to lead um, is probably not ever going to get me back to that place of, um, of being super lean and looking exactly the way that I feel like I should look. Um, but again, that doesn't mean that I'm not still trying to live a healthy lifestyle. It doesn't mean that, you know, I'm, not, that I'm forsaking exercise, um, and that type of thing. You know, I still want to be healthy. I still want to be able, but at the same time, I'm a normal person and I like wine and I like, you know, I like beer um, on occasion. I like to, you know, I'm a dessert person, so I like my sweets. Um, I want to have dessert every day. And I think there's room for that in a healthy lifestyle. Um, and so, but again, for me, that means that I'm going to, if I want to live that lifestyle, it's healthy, but... I am going to have to deal with the fact that I'm probably going to be 10 to 15 pounds over the um, arbitrary number I have in my head of what my weight should be. Um, and so I also wanted to be really transparent with my followers um, and the people that I work with that, um, you know, going on these crash diets where... Uh, you know, everybody's looking to lose the weight really, really fast. Um, actually, it creates more problems than it actually solves. And so I'm actually doing more for, for myself personally, I'm doing more of an intuitive eating thing. And it has helped me 
tremendously. Um, I am no longer binging. Um, I, I don't feel out of control around food. Um, I feel better about my body. And I'm going to be talking a lot more about intuitive eating and what it is. Um, and I'm actually going to be offering a course this fall um, because I feel like women who struggle with these issues and keep on gaining weight and losing weight and eventually you just, you know, you can't take it anymore. Um, I think that this, uh, that it could be helpful for them to um, either just look into intuitive eating and what that is, um, or even, you know, consider taking a course in intuitive eating. So anyway, um, that's sort of my story. I'm going to be talking a lot more about this stuff. So um, I hope you stay tuned to my channel. Um, if you want more information about this, um, go ahead and read my latest blog post, which is going to be, uh, the link is going to be posted in the comment section. So anyway, I hope that you all have a great day. Thanks for listening. Thanks for reading um, and have a good one. Bye.